Looks like they noticed us. Hey there. Did anybody scan you guys? Yeah. I was making sure that uh, these were not like a new enemy or anything. I think that's all. Oh no, there's one more. There's one more. All right. Well, while, while you're up there, I'm just going to take this chance to um, scan. Now, there's a lot of stuff to scan here. Here's Aether. Planet Aether, obscure world of Dasha system. The planet is unstable due to transdimensional flux. Warfare has uh, devastated a good portion of the world's population. Finally, extreme climate shifts have left most of Aether uninhabitable. Oh, you just say the same thing to um this. What about this one? Here's Dark Aether. Duplicate of Aether. Can't determine its can't determine its origin of Aether's dark twin. That contains a high level of phase on or no. Maybe bioforms attack on sun. Great. And oh yes, there's pirate love logs here too. But I'm gonna um I'm just gonna scan all of them at once because I don't wanna like read any out of order here. Okay, so we got cycle four there. Here's a cycle five. We got one from cycle six back there. And uh let me see here. Logbook, lore. Yes, space pirate logs. Cycle four, cycle five, cycle six. Yeah, we got all the ones from cycle five. And we got one from cycle six. Okay. So yeah. Um, shall we begin? I said, shall we begin? Cycle four. One, uh, oh four. Science team. Science teams have detected the presence of Phazon in the Dasha system four cycles ago. High Command authorized the deployment of our team shortly thereafter. Our orders are to establish a base on planet Aether and evaluate uh, local Phazon resources. Because this world lies on the periphery of Galactic Federation territory, we are follow following stealth protocols at the highest level. A cadre, I hope I'm pronouncing that right, a cadre of elite our commandos has been uh, dispatched to provide security for our force as well. This operation is now underway. So space riots are here too. Intelligence reports on the indig indigenous Aether, population of Aether, are in error. This planet is not at peace, nor are the inhabitants dost uh, docile. Evidence of a class 4 conflict is present here, though hostilities are a minimal level now. Our territory has suffered uh, several, several raids by a, a strange type of shadowy creature. These raids have caused considerable damage and we have requested more combat troops, troops in response. Looks like they ran into the aim too. Okay. A spatial anomaly has been found within our base. We believe this rift, rift in space-time leads to a parallel dimension of some type, but we have a uh, been unable to interact with, with it thus far. A strange artifact was found near the anomaly as well. It may be a weapon or a generator of some kind. Perhaps it is the key to act, accessing the anomaly. High Command is eager for the reports on this relic. Um, a new weapon is a, a new weapon for our arsenal is always welcome. Mm -hmm. Phase on extraction raids are underway on Dark Aether. The toxicity, oh, this one. Hmm. The toxicity of the atmosphere has taken a toll on our workforce, as have the hostile natives of that world. Science team is preparing survival gear to protect our work teams, and we have increased our security presence in instruction, extraction areas. Uh, fortunately, High Command is sending more troops and supplies. Our troops and resources are spread dangerously thin, and this mission cannot fail. 
so they found a way to get into Dark Aether now. But we found a way to. Well, thanks to them, I guess, but uh, where's that one that I missed? I guess it's not here. <clears throat> oh. Three minutes. Two hours. SpongeBob is the only guy. SpongeBob is the only guy I know who can dance with a jelly with the jelly. Hey there. For four hours, I'll get that four hours. How did that guy even get over here? Wasn't there? You can't see oh you can't. Step off. I'd step back if I were you. Anyway. Hey there. How you doing? Jeez. Jeez. Anyway, what you have to do here? Since we can't go that way, um have to find another way there. Alright. Blast door opens. Open the... Close the blast doors. Not that I watch Star Wars or anything, but... I guess we've seen uh, somewhere over there. Dark Hunter analysis. Scans of the Dark Hunter every reveal she's grow stronger than she could. Class Platinum Triple A Threat Level. Entire phase on supply. Uh, planetary stability report. Planetary energy is uh, critical, uh, creating violent climate changes and tectonic shifts. Unless these conditions can be reversed, global or global uh, destruction is inevitable. Inevitable. <clears throat> phase on supply at site one is diminishing. Sites two and three are supply rated above ninety percent. Site 4 remains a problem due to the high presence of hostile bioforms. Hmm. Yeah, those blue ones, uh, you don't have to scan them, but... Well, you don't have to scan any of them, but the blue ones that are not important for your logbook is what I'm trying to say. I have some more turrets here. These are new, apparently. Humility class turrets. I think these are a little stronger than... Oh, never mind. Red door right there, shoot it with a missile. And... That's where it's here too. And here's another one of those. Another one! And it just... Blinks out of the existence. Yeah, that's nice. I didn't know you guys could do I wish my... Can, I wish my uh, ship can do that. What are you guys doing here? Make sure it's here. Yeah. Elevator systems. Let's go up. Space pirate territory. I'm not sure when I will. I'm not sure when I'm going to stop recording here, but uh. Hey there. Bye. Can I scan these guys, please? I would like to get them from a logbook. This is kind of weird right here. This guy who's... Uh, let's see what we got. Evidence of symbiotic bonding is present in subject's system. Subject is barely, barely alive and is periodically leached of its bioenergy by metroids. Yeah. Oh, we could scan these guys for some reason, but we can't scan the other ones. Yeah. Talon Metroid. Oh yeah, what jerks? I mean, this guy... The, the... The the scan says he's barely alive. And he's slowly getting his life taken away from him. That's... Even for a space party, that's just not right. That's not right. Huh. Okay. The Hunter. Samus Aran, the, the accursed hunter, has arrived. 
The sudden arrival of the hunter is strange enough, but her actions are stranger still. She does not seek our, uh, seek our destruction, but our Phazon. With each raid, she steals Phazon ore, only killing those who attempt to deny her. What she needs it for, we do not know. Though science seems suspect that she would, uh, requires it to power her new armor suit. Dark in color, it is equipped with strange we new weapons. The troops now colored the Dark Hunter. It is a fitting title. I guess they must have ran into Dark Samus. Geez, the Space Pirates. Space Pirates, Luminoth, Gal the Galactic Federation, us, Dark Samus. Yeah. Who else is here? What is freaking like Batman and Robin gonna be here too? Because Riddler is has set up shop on planet Aether or something. No. I'm telling you, I wouldn't be surprised. Yeah, here we go. And we have some uh, arrow troopers here. I think these guys are calling. They have a holy crap. The lights are low. The lights just turned off for a second. I'm talking about like in my room. You know, I hope um, the Wii U doesn't shut off like, you know, while I'm playing. I'm not serious. I'm not kidding. Like we had a power outage. I mean, not like a power outage, but like the lights just blinked off for a second. Like for a split second, but it didn't turn off my Wii U, which is weird. I hope it doesn't do that while I'm recording. Jeez. <clears throat> I should check on my microwave. Maybe the maybe the times reset. All right, all right, that's right. You have to go here first. I wonder why that happened. It's not raining here anymore, like it was in the last recording session. But, um, hey, I, I can't imagine any other reason why that would happen. Maybe I'm using too much electricity. Maybe I should unplug my computer. Because uh, I do have it plugged up for, you know, um, I do have my computer on the charger for like the best results, uh, the best results while recording and all that. Yes. So what you want to do here is, do uh, you see how there's three tiers or three of these things on each one? You want to make steps up to uh, that door right there. But first, you want to make steps up to this. So here, so for this one right here, we have uh, one that's going up and one, one panel that's going up and one panel that's going down. We want to make all three of them go down. Not that, that. That's one, that's two, that's three. It's actually a pretty cool puzzle. So yeah. Now we want to get up there though, so we, on this one, we want to have two go down. I said two. And then on this one, we want to have one. All right. So now we can space jump up there. I can say we can space jump up there. And the three. And the uh, skiddly diddly do one, two, a skiddly diddly do. There you go, there's your energy tank. Very much appreciated. They give you a lot of uh, energy tanks early, actually. But, you know, with Dark Aether's uh, atmosphere, atmosphere, I can understand why. So, down, down. Now we want to get up that way, so we want to have. Uh, uh, three on the bottom, two on the bottom, and one on the bottom. Like so. And this cool puzzle music. And then once you, I said once you do that, you hear the doot 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 doo sound. That means you've solved it. Oh, well, you can, you know, you still can move these things around. It's just the, the puzzle music no longer plays. 
which is sad, but hey, I like that puzzle. I really do. Too bad it only plays like four times in the game. It plays a lot less than, than the puzzle music in the first game. So uh, here we have a tunnel here, another tunnel. And watch out for these lasers here. These things are firing their lasers. <clears throat> Can I get any other more unoriginal with my Hey, yeah, wow, wow, wow. And once you once you bomb out those two things, you can just get here through here. So you don't have to worry about those lasers. <clears throat> oh, a save point right here. I think I'm going to take it there. You know, the pirate log. And that's all for... Now we have one more in cycle six. Security breach. What's up? The Dark Hunter teleports into our base at will. Our security has proven next to useless against her. Her latest raid was disastrous. Not only did we lose more phase onto her, but she was also... She also crippled the stealth fill generator with her strange new weapons. We are exposed. Uh -huh. Okay, I guess I'm going to take a... I'm just going to refill energy, though. Up to an hour and three minutes here. <clears throat> All right, what's going on? Hey there. Can't scan those things, but... I wish I could do whatever's here because there is something new that we can do, but alas, I can. Uh, yeah. I think uh, if you scan these now, it's going to be here. Uh, Brimstone, yeah. So in this game, in the first game, it was Telarc Alloy for bombs, but. Okay, never mind. Uh, so in the first game, it was, uh, uh, what was it? Jeez, what was it? Um, Radeon, right? Yeah, Radeon. It was Radeon for missiles. So, and in this game, it's Brimstone. Um, so when you see Brimstone, use missiles. Something we can't get here yet. And there's a door here. Uh, only way to go is down. Same as plops down there. Looks like there are some computers that we can scan, but I don't think those are uh, pirate locks, so don't worry about them. Believe me, I would love to uh, stay here and scan all of them, like even the ones that are not important to your logbook, but that would take way too much time. And they just walk against each other. <laughs> Walking at each other. I love that cutscene. Samus is like, here we go again. This is Dark Samus right here. Did I spoil her name, by the way? When I said, oh, they ran into Dark... Oh, it looks like they ran into Dark Samus. I just realized that. Dark Samus, phase on power and entity. That's based on that. energy shield, repels, all weapons. Avoid contact with target. Will do, will do. Scans indicate the presence of Phazon and your genetic material within this entity. She wears a version of various suit altered and augmented by the Phazon within her. Primary, primary weapons include the missile launcher and a scatter shot variant of the power beam. Boost and jump ability to Boost and jump ability just are superior to yours. Hey, I don't even have the boost ball yet. The ability to generate why well, did by a lost name. Generate phase on and their energy sense is also present. <clears throat> Alright. Where are you? Get over here. Get over here so I can kick your ass. I can't kick your ass if I can't get closer. I'm doing quite a lot of damage to her. 
Yeah. Um, normally I don't use missiles on her because by the time, oh, well you're not going to let me explain, are you? Just going to use a cutscene. Yeah, she also has a selling spark. So watch out for that. Oh, Reinhardt, watch out for that. Yeah, because by the time uh, the missile gets to her, she'll just block it like that. And she almost always does. I find that the best time I hit her while she's uh, is while she's floating around like this. Or, um, yeah, see, she almost always blocks your missile, so like that. And that. And that. So I just uh, use the regular shot. You're done. Dark Sam is defeated. Jeez, man. Is that the phase on tanks as the pirates were collecting? This explodes into a bunch of pretty blue lights. Yeah, I get used to seeing her though. Because, for obvious reasons, you know. All right, let's get out of here. Don't walk into the fire, please. It's not good for you. It's not good. Yeah, let's see. Hello. Eleven o'clock p.m. <clears throat> All right, Dark Beam Acquired. Our first beam. This is basically uh, your Ice Beam here. Storyboard package. Cool. Not that I'll ever. I might. Uh, this is a pirate lore, right? Or a pirate log? Excuse me. Shadow War. Let's take a look. The local war has escalated in intensity. The shadowlings from Dark Aether, Aether has long, have launched an offensive. The assault seems to be focused on a central network of buildings atop a mountain, a base perhaps. Strangely, this is this attack coincides with the rise in planetary instability. Perhaps these shadowy creatures are using a new weapon system. The shadowlings must believe us to be foes, for they have hit our base numerous times as well. We are holding, but attrition is taking its toll on our troops and resources. Reinforcements are en route. And we can only wait and defend what is ours. Yeah, the pirates are, uh, the best. So, Dark Beam, unlike, you know, the other beams in the first game, you have limited ammo. But, to be honest, it really shouldn't be a problem as long as you remember to keep it up. I don't find it... I really don't find, you know, the limited ammo thing to be much of a big deal, but I don't know. Well, sometimes I do, but it's not that bad. Here's another pirate log, and I think I know where the last one is, because we have one more left. Let's take a look. Cycle 7, it says, another disaster. The transport bringing our reinforcements and supplies has been shot down. It was engraved, engaged in orbit, excuse me, by a Federation vessel, which has landed near the alien temple. It's only a matter of time before the Marines attack. Survivors from our ship have made their way to our base. Here we shall make our stand. Another enemy. Another enemy. First the Shadowlings, then the Dark Hunter, and now the Galactic Federation Marine Corps. Uh, perhaps... Fate will smile upon us before the world itself opens its maw and swallows us. Hmm. I guess we can read this other one since it, you know, it is here. Thanks for blue generation underwhelmed. Protocol 3 in effect until further, further notice. Exercise ex extreme caution when dealing with the birthing or storage of newborns. Remember, infinite Metroids are not pets! Exclamation mark. Hmm. So remember this room? Finally, getting on the other side. 
So we have the dark beam. It's curious dark beam. Curious. And look at what it does to um Yeah. One full recharge uh, shot. One full charge shot uh destroys on one hit. Like so. I probably shouldn't be using it that liberally, but it's cool. It's cool, it's cool. Um we are a went that way. Alright. We're actually gonna go this uh, go in here again. Because there's a missile we can pick up. We can come back here later, but I wanna do this now. Okay? I just want to. <clears throat> and uh oh, the Metroids have broken out. No. A good uh you don't have you won't get an ice beam here. But dark beam is pretty much the ice beam. So that's cool, it freezes the Metroids, just like the Ice Beam does. Whoa! You wanna, like, uh, be frozen here? Shoot, I'm running low. And I believe, uh, if you run low, you can... Um, just store crates, and usually they'll give you some. Well, will they? Oh, jeez. I better not run out here. Or else I'm gonna be screwed. Well, no, if you run out, I think they'll definitely give you some. But anyway, that's what I'm going to do. Get a missile expansion here. Oh my god. Geez, wasn't, wasn't I just saying, oh, the limited ammo wasn't a problem for me? Well, now, now look what situation you're in. All right, so let's uh, get down to brass techs here. I hear this. I, for I forgot to scan the portal. Why did it forget to scan the portal? We'll get another chance. 